he's a kid that's won at this level. He's been a, a member of Team Canada West twice. He was a captain. So he's a, a player that our, our guys definitely look up to uh, on the ice. You know, each and every night, he's one of our hardest working players, and he's always been that way. And then off the ice, he, you know, he's always at the gym. He's in the community. He's making sure he does the right things, and uh, we definitely lean on him as an organization. I think last season was tough for the Vipers. I think it uh, that was the first time we missed the playoffs in a long time. But uh, I also think it was a good learning experience for this year, and uh, guys brought a lot from that team to this team this year. I think slowly we're starting to come together as a team. Uh, I've seen a lot of good things in the last few games of uh, guys starting to come closer together and uh, we're getting better as a group every day. It's an unreal experience. I think any time you get to uh, put the Canadian jersey over your head is, uh, is an unreal feeling and uh, it was a bit huge honor to be named captain and uh, it's just too bad we came up a little short with the silver. I think Western Mich Michigan is a great organization. Uh, you look at all four of their coaches and uh, they're all great coaches. This year they're ranked pretty high and uh, I think it also gives a good balance of a good hockey program and a good school. What are you going to be taking education-wise? Do you know yet? Uh, I'm not sure yet. I'm still trying to decide. For sure, I think in my first year, uh, the main thing I learned is how to win. I've never really been on a winning winning team before, and uh, to win the Fred Page Cup and the Doyle Cup and come second in Canada was a huge learning experience for me. Time now for Rapid Fire with number 14, Aaron Hadley. And off the top, why do you wear number 14? Because uh, someone always takes 15. Adam Tambellini is your cousin, so who is better on a breakaway? <laughs> I have to go with him. It's too obvious. Best thing to do in your hometown of Castlegar? Probably go to a Castlegar Rebels game. Eggnog or mint hot chocolate? I love eggnog. Favorite TV show? Um, I have to go with 24. I'm watching it right now. It's pretty good. You're a couple years behind. Yeah, pretty good, but no. Favorite hobby? Um... Probably golf. Favorite childhood toy? Maybe one that you got for Christmas. Yeah, um, I don't know. Want to take a pass on that yeah, one? Yeah, I'll take a pass. We'll come back to that one. Christmas tree, fake or real? Oh, it's embarrassing. My mom buys a fake one. So, so you're gonna go fake, but you prefer real? I'd prefer real, but yeah, I have a fake at home. <laughs> Favorite pregame meal? Ah, uh, just spaghetti and meatballs. Which rookie has impressed you the most? with my old roommate Michael Stachuk. Really? I know he can grow a nice mustache. A very nice mustache. <laughs> Great guy too. Which player on the team should get Cole in his stocking this year? Um, I'm going to go with uh, Adam Tambellini. The cousin? You're going to throw your cousin under the bus? Yeah, I think he deserves a little Cole this year. <laughs> Funniest viper on the team this year is? Um, I don't know. I think uh, Braden Russell's a pretty funny guy. Uh, and going back to it, favorite childhood toy, have you thought of one yet? No, I can't think of one. Uh, just Hot Wheels, probably. I love Hot Wheels. And you are? Number 14, Aaron Hadley, the Vernon Vipers.